I thought, like, for sure, I'd never touch my hands. Wow. Now they're both together. Keith Thomas, a former Manhattan wealth manager, and his sister, Michelle Bennett, who's now his caregiver, have watched their lives quickly change. At 41 years old, Keith accidentally dove into a shallow pool in Montauk. I had my head at the bottom of the pool, broke my neck. Becoming paralyzed from the chest down. The accident happened in July of 2020. Keith says he stopped talking to his friends for a year and a half. I was just embarrassed that this happened to me. But he pushed through, joining a study using artificial intelligence to restore physical movement and touch through Northwell Health's Feinstein Institutes for Medical Research. The challenge was to get these tiny, tiny little fragile electrodes, hundreds of them, that are mounted on these five chips, precisely targeted to the areas of the brain that are responsible for feeling his fingertips and moving his hand. Doctors created a 3D model of Keith's brain to practice on. It worked. The 15-hour surgery in March was a success. Opening and closing his hand is what he was able to do. What was that like? It was amazing. It was unbelievable. I couldn't believe what was happening. Doctors recorded that surgery. This is the first case of this kind in the world. He can raise his hand higher, but wow. wants to do more, like wiping his own tears. Uh, I'm in such a better place now as I was when I first, first started this 